Alp Orbital launch very small satellites called Pogcubes into space. I mean, essentially, we're trying to open up access to space for groups such as uh, universities, startups, uh, really just anybody that wants to fly their satellite in space for the first time, or in many situations, we now have repeat customers who are flying constellations. Today, we're doing uh, integration with our customers. Um, we're on the October Transporter 12 mission, um, and we have two Alpopods um, on that mission. So we are doing today the integration of our first satellite. The initial idea for the, for the satellite, for Prometheus one, is to be used as a learning tool on the classroom. So we want to have a set of those satellites, like five, ten, and when students are learning for the first time satellite engineering or satellite design, they can really put their hands on a real satellite. We are giving space to the classroom. That's for our goal. Hello Space is a space-based uh, uh, small satellite company. We manufacture pocket cubes. Basically, we aim to have uh, close to real-time uh, communication with our satellites. It's been a very long journey and we are really excited to the launch with, with Alba Orbit. We named our satellite Hype because we want to make Hype and we are really hyped about uh, this project and it's uh, really fun because you can see your face in space. As you can see, we have this selfie stick here and the camera. Uh, and also we have the display, so pretty much we can take pictures of what's on the display and send it back to Earth. Hydrospace is a small startup in Spain, Madrid. Uh, started in, uh, to provide IoT communication services. Uh, we are building our technology step by step, but we allow uh, some customers and partners to come with us as a payload and test their technologies into space. Different payloads from all over the place, universities, research institutes, uh, small companies, um, uh, or even high school students, they're playing, I don't know, chess or doing some Morse code in space. Today I'm so excited because this is our first step for uh, going into orbit. We are trying to develop an innovative thermal control system for satellites. I think Pocket, Pocket Cubes represent a very uh, unique platform because it's uh, extremely like, uh, competitive in terms of price, but also is uh, powerful enough to provide a robust demonstration of our technology. Pocket Cube is a very interesting form factor, it's like a Rubik Cube, so it's quite easy to work with. Uh, small size, uh, it's only PCBs, uh, so it can be a very low cost solution. I think it's a very ideal form factor for the learning and for education. Uh, the difference between Pocket Cube and uh, other satellites like, like CubeSats is that it's way smaller, so it's way cheaper. And, it, and thanks to that, it is actually possible for students to send it to space and test our technology. You would be surprised how, how much a small satellite can do actually in space. Alba Orbital was already there, they've always been there for us. You can either develop your own platform and work everything, or you can uh, contact people or get in touch with someone that already has uh, some pocket cube and some free space. And they will get you in and you can start trying your technology and it will be less scary to begin this journey. Everything that we did was a learning curve for us. And, uh, and it was very helpful to have this uh, follow-up and guiding along the process. Otherwise, we'll, be, we'll still be uh, a couple of months behind trying to figure out how to put everything together to, to be able to launch a satellite. Before, we were really struggling to find a way to go into space. When we look at Arba Orbital, we find the affordable prices, and this is what we, we really like. It is our first mission, but stay tuned because uh, many are, <laughs> are will follow. Yeah. Uh, long term, we're, we're planning to fly hundreds of satellites. Um, we hopefully can get over 100 pal cubes to orbit as a community by next year. Um, so that'll be really exciting. Uh, and really just show that the standard's here and it's viable for lots of folks. And there's a really big community now building and launching stuff and, and get their missions done in orbit. Really just anything you can imagine that they can fit in the cube. Uh, people are trying things and it's really exciting because it's very uh, experimental and, and lots of new innovations are happening.